Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'm going to show you a few tricks that you can use to make your Bitcoin earning faster on CryptoTab browser. So let's jump right into it. Okay, so here is my CryptoTab browser and now I'm going to turn on the mining in here and I will put it into maximum. And now as you can see my mining rate is about 500 uh, hash per second. Now we will go back and apply uh, the tricks and then we will come back again and see how much the hashing rate is. So first of all we need to go to the search box and search for MS config and click on system configuration. After that come back to the boot menu and then click on advanced options now in here on the right side where it says maximum memory just check this if you are using 8 megabyte of ram make sure that this is 8192 and then in here make sure the number of processors is selected as 4 processors click on ok now And then apply and OK. So we will exit without restart now. So this goes for the first step. For the second step, right click on this PC and go to properties. From the left hand side, click on advanced system settings. Under the performance, click on settings. Now choose are just for best performance. Apply and OK. So now let's go back to the advanced tab and click on performance and then click on advanced. And here under the virtual memory, just click on change. Deselect this automatically manage paging file size for all drives. And check this custom size for the initial size and in MB put 1000 for maximum size put 17000 click on set ok so the changes you have made require you to restart your computer before they can take effect so we will click ok and then once again here where it says adjust for best performance of background services. Apply and click OK. And then just close out of this. We will say restart later. Now the other trick is to go to your control panel and uninstall unnecessary program that you don't need on your computer. Search for add and remove programs. So just go through this list and uninstall any program that you think are not necessary. For example, this one Bluestack app is not necessary for me so I'm going to just uninstall this. I don't need this program either so I will uninstall. The same way I will go through the list and uninstall any program that I don't need. You should do the same. Now that I have installed all the application and software that I don't necessarily need them, now we will go to our next step. Just right click on your taskbar and go to task manager. Now on the first one, right click and go to details. 
right click on the browser that exe and set the priorities as now this takes us to our next trick and for that we are going to press a shortcut key on our keyboard uh, press windows plus r now search for percentage t e m p and percentage press ctrl a and delete everything on this folder press windows plus r key once again and this time search for t e m p and delete everything you see on this folder Once again press Windows plus R and search for Prefetch. Again delete everything on this folder. Don't worry you are not going to break anything on your computer. And last but not the least press windows plus r key for the last time and search for recent and delete everything from here as well and now let's go and empty our recycle bin right click and click on empty recycle bin Now let's go to our CryptoTab browser and see if the mining rate has changed or not. And here as you can see the mining rate has changed to 1000 hash per second. One last tip is that you need to restart your computer for all these settings to take effect uh, and the mining rate will change again. So I'm going to restart the computer now. So we just did all of the tricks and restarted the computer. Now let's go to our CryptoTab browser and see if the mining rate has increased or not. And yes, as you can see in here, the mining rate is right now from 1200 to 1500 hash per second. So this is how you can increase the mining rate on CryptoTab browser without any hack or without any uh, software. It's all legit and you don't need any extra boost or any extra software for that. With that we come to the end of this video. Please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more such videos. I will see you guys in the next video.